Hey everyone, AJ here just giving you an update on the uh, ick treatment using the uh, Ruby, Re uh, Ruby Reef Ick Attack or Kick Ick, whatever it's called. Um, my fish are doing okay, they're still eating, however my powder blue is honestly looking worse than ever. Um, so I've gone ahead and made the decision um, that tomorrow I'm going to get all the fish out of the tank and they're going to go in quarantine. Um, which typically the quarantine would have to be for about two months. However, I'm going on vacation in about six weeks. So what I'm going to do is I've got more uh, kick ick getting delivered today. It's a 14 day treatment. The fish are going to go in quarantine. They're going to get treated. I'm going to use the kick ick as instructed to kill off the ick parasite as it goes up, as it leaves the sand bed and goes into the water column looking for a host, um, just to help speed up the process. And about a week before I go to vacation, I want to put the fish back in here where it's a more stable system and I don't have to worry about my uh, house sitter watching multiple systems and having to do water changes while I'm gone on the quarantine system. So that's where we're at. Obviously, I, I feel it was. It was beneficial because my regal tang seems to be doing much better. All the other fish are fine, but the powder blue just—they're they're still the ick parasite still going after the powder blue. So I don't feel it is a complete aquarium treatment, which I had my doubts, but I thought I would try it. Um, so that's where we're at. So tomorrow they will go into quarantine for about five weeks, um, and then they'll go back in here, and I'm going to treat the tank um, with with it being fallow, and hopefully kill the ick parasite as it enters the water column. And instead of having it be fallow for 60 days, I should be able, I can hopefully get away with 45 uh, days, give or take a day or two. Anyhow, that's just a quick update. Everyone have a good one.